So our topic is now painting and what we are going to do is paint four walls of a room and our four walls are there. What we've done is unsnap them and fold them out completely. And this one's five meters, this one's three, this one's five, this one's three. I'm going to try that again. Five, three. And our walls are generally about 2.4 meters high. So that's what we're going to work with today. My picture's not great. I'm very sorry. So there's four very clear steps for what we have to do to figure out how much paint we are going to need. We need to figure out the area of what we're painting. We need to figure out the amount of paint we are going to need in litres. And we are going to figure out how many tins we need. And then we're going to figure out how much it costs in doshlings or dollars, whatever you want to talk about. Alright, first step. We need to look at the area that is being painted. Now we can treat this as one giant wall. If we add these ones up and multiply it by the height. So we've got length times width, it's a rectangle. We've got a length. If we add these all up, we get a length of 16. And our height is 2.4. And that gives us 38 square meters that we are going to need to cover. So we found the area easy. If we need to then talk about, okay, well, I need to get some paint and your paint coverage will be given to you. So the paint is going to cover today. It's going to cover three square meters for every litre. So to find our paint in litres, we are going to say, right, how much is our area? Divide it by our coverage, how much it's going to cover, and that will give us how many litres we need. Area is 38. Sorry, it's 38.4. Miss Crawford got that one wrong. Divided by our 3. We're going to cover 3 square metres per litre, remember. And that's going to give us, we need 12.8 litres to cover our whole four walls. Now, the next step is saying, right, unfortunately the paint only comes in tins that hold three litres in them. All right. In order to figure out how many tins we need, we're going to have to say how many litres do we need and we are going to divide that by how many litres in one tin and that would be 12.8 litres that we found before divided by three which means we need 4.27 tins. Now we can't buy 0.27 of a tin so what we have to do is round it up and buy five tins. 